There's a huge invasion of cold brew coffee beverages on the market in 15 million different varieties. They're spiked, they're this and that. Are they any good? Should you, should you join the club or should you kind of look the other way? Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another topical vlog. And this is about uh, cold brew beverages. They're all over the place. We were over at uh, Whole Foods recently and there was this entire refrigerator case filled with a whole lot of different kinds of cold brew coffees. Um, and I bought one because I was kind of thirsty. I, my drink in the car had uh, been finished and I got this uh, Nitro Beverage Company uh, cold brew. They had a plain one unsweetened and another one made with coconut, the essence of coconut, uh, coconut water and so on. I bought the coconut one. They're a local company out of Asbury Park, so it felt good to support your local uh, local businesses. But I drank it uh, quickly and you know, Nitro has gives it that flavor. You know, just for reference, I actually like the Starbucks Nitro coffee and I feel fine drinking it. But this particular Nitro beverage company, I, I don't know what they put in it. They claim it's perfectly, um, no additives or anything, but I felt like crap. Uh, after drinking, I felt again like something um, had gone wrong. Maybe it was the coconut, maybe it was a bad batch, but I did not feel good after drinking this particular canned beverage. Um, so I, I, and another thing about these cold brews and all these, you know, fancy uh, artisan beverages is that they're extremely expensive. And you know, these were on sale for four dollars a can. Imagine if Coca-Cola or water was $4 a can if you're not at a baseball stadium. Um, it's an expensive habit to entertain. And it, you're gonna laugh, but I drink the cheapest instant coffee you can get. It's $2.95 for 120 cups. And I get it over at Aldi, uh, Aldi, sorry, Aldi. And um, it's, uh, it's really good coffee. I don't feel like crap after drinking it. And I just somehow think these, these, these new healthy or trendy uh, companies are, are just not, not good. I think it's a bad habit to get into. And there's literally a hundred different brands of this new nitro or cold brew coffee in small batches and this and that. It's an expensive habit. You know, I, I, like I said, I can drink 120 cups of coffee for less than the price of one can of this stuff. And I think you're just better off finding a finding an alternative to it. I mean, at the very worst, you go go to Starbucks and they'll freshly brew your coffee there on the spot um, instead of something that has to sit in a can for weeks or months. So I, that's it. I, I'm not I'm not on the on board with the with the nitro cold brew coffees in a can sold at delis and supermarkets. What are your thoughts? Have a nice weekend. <laughs>